Hi, I'm Rachel, a mom of three kids, Alex, Richie, and Ethan. We decided to leave our home country in the USA to travel the world, starting in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Join us on our fun, crazy, and average everyday lives while we journey around the world. Travel Cat Family. Hey, cool cats. Today, we're going to try Nan Mai, which is a woodworm that is typically eaten in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Me, my brother, my sister, and my mom are all going to try this, so let's get started. So I'm going to eat this right now. You're not going to finish it? <laughs> Beautiful. It tastes like, the shell tastes like nothing, but just the inside, it's like a field of a weird feeling. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> Would you ever eat them like, again? Don't even say that. I can still taste it in my spit. <laughs> okay, so now it's my turn to eat a non uh, my. And okay. Richie was going to eat it, but he got scared. So Yeah, he was going to eat it next after Ethan, but he got scared. Okay. Yeah, okay. Show them what it is first. <laughs> uh, Can't be any worse than a cricket. I know. <laughs> um. Okay, so it was gross. And the outside was plain, like Ethan had said. The inside, it was like really dry and flaky, but not like the good flaky. It was, um, <laughs> you know how you eat food and it's flaky and it's good, but this was like, it kind of tastes like wood, like its name suggests. But um, it tastes, I don't know, it was gross. It's really gross. Okay, so I'm going to attempt to try a wood worm. So gross looking. Let's see which one should I pick? Oh my gosh. Ew. That is so gross looking. It smells rancid. Like when you know how when you eat something you didn't know was like out of date? Like, what have I eaten that's rancid that's out of date that tastes really nasty? That's what it smells like. I'm kind of scared to eat this one more than the cricket. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ew, it's all greasy. Yeah. And yeah, that's from the well, oil, they, though, that they yeah. cooked it in. They fry it in Did you stuff. eat the whole thing and swallow it? Yeah. Okay. Was it really that gross? Um, I mean, it was edible if it was necessary for me to eat it to live. <laughs> Like if we got stranded on but, the island? Yeah, <laughs> but I wouldn't ever eat it again. Okay, here goes. Oh, it wasn't squishy? No, it wasn't okay. squishy. It was really flaky. Ew, the thought of eating poop or something. Crickets are better. Crickets taste like salty crisps. Yeah. I'd take crickets any day. Mm. Oops. <laughs> that was that was not like utterly horrible as in, oh my gosh, I'm gonna die horrible. But it tastes 
thoughts about it. I wouldn't eat it again. Yeah, it was flaky and dry like wood, huh? I need something to spit in. I really um, do. Like, seriously. Richie, go get something. Turn off the camera. Okay, so it's Richie's turn and he is not happy about this. At least try. I know, at least try. Very funny. That's probably what it tastes like anyway. It's a type of leaf or something. Actually, it does just taste like wood, like boring wood. Just pick a small one. You don't even have to eat the whole thing, just like the little tip of it or something. If you at least try and you eat a tip of it and you can spit it out if you don't like it, then I'll buy you two Copex on payday. Is it Copex or Copex? Copex. Oh, Copex. Okay. Two of them on payday. Copex. Yep. If you just take a little tip off of it and at least chew it a teeny bit and then if you need to spit it out, you can. You don't want to? Okay, so Richie doesn't want to. It's disgusting. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. And the question of the day, of the day, would you ever want to eat a wood Bye, see ya. Bye guys, see you next time. Yeah.